And we're here with our Insta MD, Dr. Dorian. Uh, coronavirus is the most politicized issue we have, and we're eight days till the election. White House Chief of Staff says we're not going to control the pandemic. Could we have? Yeah, and we still can. Uh, I think that's totally throwing in the towel. If we mask, distance, and sanitize, we bring the rates down. That's controlling it. You know, on Good Morning America, COVID explosion. President Trump on Twitter today. Cases are up because we test, test, test fake news media conspiracy. Is it possible that both are right? There is a component of what he's saying that is correct. A component. A component. Uh, but also the positivity is going up, which means, yeah, we're testing more, but we're, there's more people who are positive with COVID. It's not just because we're testing more. The rate, right? The number... But is it okay because you doctors have figured out how to do it? You got your remdesivir going. You got your... You guys are keeping the death rates very low. Yeah, so that's actually an excellent point. Before, if you were hospitalized, you had like a 25% chance of not making it. Now it's down to like 8%. So we're, we're making improvements, but you still don't want to be part of that 8%. The Oxford COVID-19 vaccine has prompted some immune response in young adults, which is sort of exciting, and also elderly adults. Um, what does that tell us? It tells us it's working. It tells us that we are on the right path there. It, it's going to work. We just need to give it a little bit more time. We've got to make sure we do all the tests. We're not bringing it out too early. Once we have the vaccine and it really has gone through the test and not pressured by anybody to get it out, trust the system, trust science, and then we have to use the vaccine. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.